How to create scarcity as an affiliate. Guys, what is up? Uh, this is Cam Jennings. Uh, thanks so much for hanging out with me today. And uh, I want to give you some affiliate marketing tips. I'm in the middle of promoting this product uh, from Lee Murray called Enter the Niche. I really think it's a great affiliate marketing package. It's a lot of done for you content in there. Um, and it's just a very valuable package for a very low price. And I, I, I respect that. And I think it's awesome. I think everybody who wants to do affiliate marketing or who is doing affiliate marketing should pick it up. It's, it's great. Um, so what I want to do now is I want to give you some value um, just as an affiliate marketer, because I know a lot of you guys are picking up this package and you know, you're affiliate marketers and you're going to want to how to use it to be, use it to the best of your ability. Okay. So um, one tactic that marketers use is scarcity, right? Um, but many times you'll see product vendors using scarcity, right? They'll either uh, be up in the price of a product after a certain time period, or they'll be taking the product off the marketplace after a certain time period, or, or they'll be removing a special bonus after a certain time period. And, you know, it's funny because as affiliates, you think, well, I can talk about the scarcity. I can leverage the scarcity of the product vendor, but I can't necessarily use the scarce. I can't create scarcity as an affiliate. I can't do it. That's not true. You can create scarcity as an affiliate. And I want to give you two ways to do it uh, right now uh, that I think will help you a lot. All right. So uh, the first way is really straightforward and, and easy, right? So the first way to leverage scarce, the first way to create scarcity as an affiliate even if there isn't any scarcity, like if you're promoting an evergreen product or something is to offer a valuable bonus, right? And you can say, Hey, listen, man, I'm promoting this product. I'm offering this bonus for this period of time. All right. When you buy this product through my link, you're going to get this thing, right? It's awesome, but I'm going to be taking it away at this day and this time. Right. And I think it's important to have a reason right? It's important to have a reason. You got to have a reason. Okay. If you don't have a reason, it feels like fake scarcity, you know, a little bit. Now, a very simple reason to take away a bonus is this is too valuable for me to leave here forever. I'm not just going to leave here this here indefinitely. It's worth far more than the six or $7 that you're spending on this product. So this is a special thing just for like these three or four days. Okay. Then I'm taking it away because it's worth more than what, it is when you buy this product. Very, very simple, but it's a very important detail. You have to give a reason why you're taking something away. All right. Um, look, real scarcity works. Fake scarcity can work, but it's BS and nobody respects it. And, you know, it doesn't really work if people hang around you that long and they realize you're just faking them out and it's all nonsense and you lose a lot of credibility. So don't do it you know, use real scarcity. It's not that hard to make real scarcity. All right. So the bonus thing is, is one. All right. Now the second thing, let's say you don't got time to create a bonus. You don't have any time to create a bonus. You're not messing around with bonuses. All right. I don't got any time for that crap. All right. Understand. So here's the second way that you can create scarcity as an affiliate. Okay. What you have to understand is that people are being bombarded with information. We're in a 24 hour news cycle and it's not just your emails going out to people. It's not just your messages going out to people on Facebook. Everybody's putting messages out there on Facebook. Everybody is uh, being bombarded in their inbox. Everybody's sending messages on their, in people's inboxes. Okay. So here's the second way you can create scarcity. You can tell people simply, right? Now, listen, I'm not going to be promoting this product after today anymore. Today is my last day to promote this product. And let me tell you something, my friends. After that, it's just going to be another blown opportunity buried under a sea of emails that were written far worse than this one. <laughs> far less enjoyable than this email. Okay. It's going to be another blown opportunity because it's going to be buried in a sea of messages. You're going to forget about it. And it's going to be gone, gone like the wind, right? Just another blown opportunity, right? So what we're doing here is we're leveraging the fact that we're all being bombarded by information and we're in a 24 hour news cycle and it's hard to remember crap. And a message like that, what that's going to do is that's going to remind people, Hey man, I'm not going to have this guy reminded me of this thing anymore. I might want to pick that up, but I'm going to forget about it. 
let me just go ahead and go get it now so I don't forget about it because I'm not going to be reminded of it anymore. He's telling me right now I'm not going to be reminded of it anymore. Right. So this is another form of scarcity. And it's the scarcity. It's the scarcity of, you know, that reminder. Right. I'm taking away the reminder from you. You're not going to have the reminder anymore. I'm taking it away. This is a good form of scarcity. It's not as powerful as uh, the huge value bonus scarcity, but we don't always have time to produce a huge value bonus scarcity. Also, these two forms of scarcity, you can combine them together and use them and they work like gangbusters. Anyways, guys, that's two ways to create scarcity as an affiliate. They work amazing together. And I highly suggest you pick up Lee Murray's Enter the Niche. It's really, really sweet. And it's going to help you if you're an affiliate marketer. That's all I got, guys. Have a fantastic Monday and I will see you in the next one. Leave me a comment. Let me know you're alive out there. Peace, everybody.